Moin Moin und herzlich willkommen zu meinem Let's Play von Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Ich bin euer Mr. Bebop und dies ist Folge 67 und ich wünsche euch jetzt viel Spaß. Und hoch da. Das wird ein langer Weg. Zum Beat. Wo bin ich hier? Tierwarte. Und ein Container. Bingo. Come on, don't fail me now. Sehr schön. Voll hier ist ja gar nichts mehr. Kann ich den ganzen Weg zurücklaufen oder was? Es ist wie, es gibt noch Grund, um zu Gar kein Bock. <lacht> ähm, kann ich mir hin teleportieren? Ja, ne? Nee, kann ich nicht. Schade. Na gut, dann laufen wir. Moin. Moin, alles klar. Oh, 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 ich bin tot. Das war so nicht geplant. Perfekt. I don't I should I damn more. Geht doch an da. Weiter. Wir gehen zu unserem Ausgangspunkt zurück, um Shanaya weiter zu folgen. Äh, ich kann nicht Arsch rufen. Ah, kann ich doch nicht. Geht schon mehr später. Schon naja, weiter geht's. Ich bin wieder zurück vor meiner Gründungstour. Da geht's den Weg. Uroboros. Uroboros, ja. So they're Uroboros? And they're from Kevus and Agnes. But they're just a bunch of kids. Watch yourselves. They could be secret spies. It's over. This place will be a war zone. They're all whispering about us. I feel we're not exactly welcome here. Uninvited guests, one might say. They're the ones who led us here. 
Oh, hey! Doesn't she look similar to the Mobius we fought at Colony 4? It's true. Wrinkly prude faces abound here. Mananas by tiny people too! It's whole undiscovered race! No. They must be... humans, just like us. So you're Ouroboros, eh? Huh? You've got, what, one or two years left? Some hope you are. Don't know why Van Dam wasted that power on you. What was he thinking? <sighs> What's your problem? Mind your manners. Let me introduce you. These were our Ouroboros candidates. They trained relentlessly to fight against Mobius. Each and every one of them. That includes Shania there. Candidates? You happy? That you stole Ouroboros from us? <sighs> Alright, that's enough. Whatever the reason, the old man did choose him. To be fair, they have gone against quite a few Mobius already. They're the real thing, all right. You heard Shania's reports. What reports? I had her monitor your actions with extreme scrutiny. All the way from the valley. Huh? Since way back then? <laughs> Together, we are united in our cause. Miss Vanden. Uh, all right then. Please, it's not their fault. They're not a bad lot, really. That's easy for you to say. Well, that was awkward as all ash. We got new folks on the map. Was sind das hier? We got new folks on the map. I'll introduce you to them another time. Abts, der Stille. All right. We got new folks on the map. Some relationships changed. Some relationships changed. Astel Harpen, the Schmier. Some relationships changed. Wir haben noch nie ein Trier gibt es denn hier. Das ist der Wahnsinn. Ich hatte der Hammer. Hm, das riecht gut. Guten Tag. Das war die Mishiba Kantine. Direkt speichern. Got to note this all down. Everyone got their strength back. Bevor Shania. Das ist Shania, Shania. I don't know. You um, you said that you were monitoring us earlier. So is that why, why you stormed the castle? After the Ouroboros stone activated, Shania relayed the info straight back to us. So I've been looking for a chance to contact you. Oh, really? We reckoned that you would just head straight here. What we did not expect was for you to dive straight into the heart of the enemy's base. Ah. Uh. I was flipping out. Your actions were so reckless. I started to wonder if our saviors were just a bunch of raven lunatics. They kind of looked that way. That's a little too harsh. <laughs> Sorry. Poor choice of words. How about hotheads? 
Yeah, that's not a lot better. Still, it helped us complete one of our primary objectives. Securing a number of growth modules. What are those? I'll show you. You'll find it quite interesting. It's the very reason why we fight. Wie könnte Taiyuwelen herstellen, wenn es möglich ist? Was mich... Nichts, ne? Den immer. Wo oh, Teile. Na gut, dann ist das so. I definitely feel stronger. Everyone got their strength back. Container. Cool. Ich habe auf die Karte geachtet. Nicht zu. Hier war ich vorhin auf der anderen Seite dieses Zauns. Hier ist aber nichts weiter, was interessant ist. Gut, hier auch nicht. Das ist einfach das Wohnviertel. Schade. Ich muss das alles dann zu hier. Ich will doch nur mal gucken. nichts los. Klinik. 
wir alles hier. Gedenksteine. Nette Idee. Nicht gut. Someday. Gut, da bin ich wieder an diesem Marktplatz. Was haben wir denn da noch? Ähm, gar nichts. Gut. sogar Bäume drin. Ist echt schön gemacht. Ich. Ah, was haben wir denn hier? Halle der Erinnerungen. jetzt nicht, ob mir diese Figuren bekannt vorkommen. Vielleicht aus dem ersten Teil. Weiß ich warum, ich habe aber mehr Erinnerungen an den zweiten Teil als an den ersten. Liegt vielleicht daran, dass ich den zweiten zuerst gespielt habe. Weil es switch-technisch nicht anders möglich war. Der erste Teil kam für die Switch erst später raus. Kann man also noch hochgehen. Aber nichts Interessantes. Man kennt es. Und da habe ich auch noch eine Treppe gesehen. Ach so. Okay. Da war ich ja schon. Komm ich da hoch? Da hoch irgendwo. Andere kommen. Ja. Ja, morgen hier noch einfach da durchgehen können. Ist ja nur wirklich nichts. Also so gar nicht. Hm. Unnötig. Now I know how you guys felt in Colony 4. Right? At least they warmed up to us eventually. Maybe it'll be the same here. We're now more or less above the sword's hilt guard. Even this place was once ravaged by war. 
by Kevis and Agnes. Has the war really spread this far? There's even more. More husks underneath. Sicher jetzt erst. Richtige <sighs> Schlachtfeld. This right here is what the world is really like. Designed to keep us shackled. Keep us shackled? Who will be with us? Hey, Noah. You know that pile of husks earlier? You aren't thinking about sending those on, are you? Okay, here I not. Aren't those cradles? Your so called cradles are the growth modules that birthed you. You were conscripted from birth. Trained to kill one another ruthlessly and steal each other's life. That life energy pours into the flame clocks, becoming the fuel that feeds Mobius. In order for Mobius to exist, they must continue to claim life energy. And these cradles right here, they're used to recycle your lives. Ethel. Yeah. You live your lives in servitude so that Mobius can exist. And even in death, there's no release. You'll just keep getting recycled. No way. Also hatte ich ja nicht Unrecht. There's your shackles. Und ich habe keine Erinnerung mehr an ihr voriges Leben. Soldiers bound by Mobius' shackles are destined only for mutual destruction. Those who lose their lives in battle, they're reborn anew. They wake from a castle cradle. A blank slate without a scrap of their former memories. Wait, then that husk I saw. But if we keep your lives bound to the bodies, as we're doing here, they're of no use to them. This way we can whittle away at their power. So you've been doing this over and over again then? That's right. You don't want to know for how long, believe me. And yet, the price we pay to take down just a handful of Mobius is immeasurable. The city's residents, we're all descendants of the first Ouroboros. The first Ouroboros? What's a descendant? Uh, right. That's not a word you'd have any use for either, I suppose. Better to see for yourselves. Come, I'll show you. Okay, also hatte ich recht. Lag nur mit, eigentlich mit einer Sache falsch. Es sind keine neuen. Es sind die Personen. Also es ist nicht so, der andere stirbt, dann ist er weg und jetzt wird ein neuer Körper quasi. Ja. Doch, einerseits schon. Es ist ein neuer Körper. Im Prinzip ist es jetzt... Lance stirbt, Lance löst sich auf, Lance wird wieder in dieser Kapsel neu geboren, ohne Erinnerung. So ist das Prinzip. Jetzt ist die Frage, wie kann es sein, dass Juni sich selber gesehen hat, obwohl sie ja nie... Doch, sie hat... Stimmt, sie ist auf dem Schlachtfeld gestorben. Nur ihre Körper quasi ist dort geblieben. Gesteinert oder wie auch immer. Als sie gestorben ist, wurde sie neu hergestellt. Neu geboren, in Anführungsstrichen. Sie ist jetzt da und ist sich selber begegnet. Krass.
die Klinik ist auf. Where are we? This is a maternity ward. Maternity? Doctor, may I? Ich kann mir auch sehr gut vorstellen, dass diese Lebensmittel, die jeder hat, wie unsere sechs Kameraden hier, dass die gar nicht bindend ist. Und wird das nur vorgegaukelt und am quasi letzten Tag eben zu diesem It's so small. It's a little person. werden aufgelöst. It's so teensy tiny, but it move. Much rejoicing. It's okay to touch her. Gently now. Try it too. Oh. Whoa, you're right. Mimi, it's incredible. L let me have a turn. What? <laughs> This is incredible, Senna. Funny, right? But this is human beings' true nature. If you want the ins and outs, go and ask the doctor. All right then, lads and lasses. Who wants to know how babies are made? Aufklärungsunterricht. <laughs> hmm. Well, you're in for a surprise. Buckle up. Schön Biologieunterricht, Aufklärung, Abfahrt.
This is how it should be. This is human nature. We are born defenseless, grow up. Then those who find a spouse create new life together, age, then return to the earth. Thank you. I mean it. Monica. What was that word you used? Spouse? A partner in romance. Ro... The feeling of having someone very precious to you. That'd be one way of putting it. You'll understand too someday. Or it might be that you already do. Krasse Erfahrung jetzt für die sechs. Ich hatte die Nordpons ja auch. Theoretisch. Ja ganz neue Sachen, die sie da erfahren. Die muss man erstmal verarbeiten. Ah, da waren wir ja auch schon. Look. Hmm. It looks the same as the one before. Who are they? The first Ouroboros. The founders, we call them. The first Ouroboros. That one. She looks a bit like Mimi. Look at this. He's got Noah's chin. And the others... They don't look like anyone. Tell us about them. Long, long ago, they gained the power of Ouroboros. It let them match Mobius blow for blow. The city folk you see here, we're all descended from them. Bound by their blood. Mm. It was the Queen's, so they say. Kevis and Agnes, their powers united, created Ouroboros. Ouroboros are the only ones that can take down a Mobius. Although, there can only be six Ouroboros alive at one time. By activating the stone's cage here, those with aptitude can become Ouroboros. Only six? Why so few of them? I get it. That's why they got so upset. Finally clicked? There's only so many seats and stones. The one that my father was moving. It took a long time to be found. I think I'm finally getting the gist of this whole Ouroboros deal. But the Queens? Not those sham figureheads in the castles. The real Queens. 
Yes, real queens. I knew that soulless piece of clockwork junk wasn't the real deal. Does that mean our queen is false too? Mm. We're still trying to pinpoint the true queens. They're out there somewhere, sleeping. What for? Why else? To take our world back from Mobius and set things to rights. The true queens will help us there. Hang on a bleeding second. Ouroboros were born, like, generations ago, right? But you said the queens are sleeping. Are there humans who can even live that long? Now that, I don't know too much about. Then what do you know? Well, the legend goes that both of the queens, their lifespans are supposed to be incomparably longer than ours. And you're pinning your hopes on that? At the moment, that's about all we can do. All right. So, when the world is back to rights, then what? The people you've seen here, the way they live their lives, that could be everyone. Babies, children, adults, the old. They're all a part of nature's cycle. And that would go... for us, too. Hmm. There'll be more to life than just fighting to survive. We'll weave the tale that we were always meant to tell. Don't give up. Ten years? You kids deserve better. The only thing that can change all this is the will of Ouroboros. You kids and your love. Though, some of us around here still ain't too keen on the idea. What? So, those people from before, they're happy living in the moment. As long as they can hide away and cover their eyes, they don't give a damn about the rest. So our lives mean nothing to them? If they can't see or hear you, then as far as they're concerned, you don't even exist. Closing their eyes to what's in front of them. A lot of folks here think that way. But that's... That's just like Mobius. Then the only difference is whether or not they benefit directly. You catch on quick. I can see why my dad chose you guys. But the will of the Founders, it lives on in us warriors. Mobius can't reign forever. If we can continue freeing young folk like you, Maybe life can get back to how it should be. That would be best for all of us. For sure. I'm with you. I think we'd have to be lunatics not to believe you, after what you've shown us. <laughs> I believe it too. Seeing how you live your lives, it made me feel really envious. Feeling that warmth, part of nature's cycle. We need to protect that. I agree. It was so... precious. Ja, und damit sind wir auch am Ende dieser Folge angekommen. Wenn ihr wissen wollt, wie es weitergeht, schaltet unbedingt in der nächsten Folge auch wieder ein. Würde mich sehr freuen. Lasst gerne ein Abo da, wäre sehr nice von euch. Und ich würde sagen, bis zum nächsten Mal.